everybody, it's your blue man, Mr. Fudge, and we're going to be making a lobster today. And we're going to do that with two red balloons with about a hand's width on each side. A red balloon with a puff of air, which means I just, as hard as I could without blowing it up, and then I tied it off and cut it. I'm going to be using a white balloon tied off on one side and the other for eyes. And then I'm using basically one balloon scrap cut in half for the claws for rubber bands later, which look really, really cute and amazing, and we'll get to that in a second. So the first thing with a lobster is to make its claw. So we make one bubble, we make another bubble slightly larger, and then follow that with an ear twist. So that becomes our claw. Then we make another joint, and something like that. And we're going to repeat on the other side. So again, make a bubble, one slightly larger, follow that by an ear twist, a medium bubble, a joint, and then one slightly larger, and an ear twist. So now we have basically our lobster body. At this point, both of those ear twists get twisted together, and that becomes what's going to hold the arms apart of your lobster. I then take the two balloons together, twist them on their side like so. I then, as one balloon, twist these together and ear twist them. I then rearrange them so they hold kind of like that. I then make two more bubbles, same way, and ear twist them. And these should all hold on top of themselves a little bit but it's okay to get a curl because lobster's tails are curled anyway. So I'm going to give that one more twist. I usually give it about three or four of these when I'm making them. And at this point, I'm literally just folding these guys in on themselves. So make a quick little bubble. lost one, and then that becomes the lobster tail, right? At this point, we're going to add in our eyes, we're going to tie on our bands for the hands, which literally is just wrapping around the balloon and tying it off, cutting off any excess. This gives it a slightly cleaner look. And then doing the same thing on the other side. Tying that off. Now, I don't know if you noticed, but these balloons that I use here, I actually tied off on one side and then pulled the air out and tied it off so that it stayed like a rubber band rather than a half blown up balloon. It makes it easier to work with. So we've got this point right here for our lobster and then our nice little antenna. And those go out the front like so. And now we have our amazing Mr. Lobster. Thank you. 